I mean, I, I think it was the first time that it dawned just how serious this is. Mm. And actually, I think my one well criticism said. is that maybe we should have been given this sense of how severe this was a bit sooner, because I think yesterday was the first time that people got, got it and thought, wow, OK, this is something that is unprecedented and we need to be taking very seriously. I think the government strike the right tone, to be fair, mm. um, and I think it's completely right that they are trying to be driven by the evidence. I think when we have a new virus that we're still grappling with, the scientists themselves are just learning about this thing. So we are all a bit adrift, and when we're a bit adrift, we can do nothing but hanker on and anchor ourselves in the information that we have. The one thing I would say, though, is, you know, even with the best evidence and the scientific advice, the modelling they're doing is modelling. It's mm -hmm. not perfect. It's not a perfect science. So there will be judgment calls that are being applied. And I think some of the variation we're seeing between countries are judgment calls about, you know, how risk averse are you about when the peak might be? Mm. Four weeks. It could be three. It could be two. We're not quite sure. There will be questions about the set of interventions you put in place at a particular time and the impact. And those are judgment calls that the Prime Minister is making. And you just have to hope they're the right judgment calls.